My name is Karis Wilson. I'm a Northern Irish artist based in Belfast. This show is titled Time Frames. It's an accumulation of multiple experiments whilst on the residency here at TAGD for the last two months. A lot of the experiments have been created using a TV screen, sections of a TV screen that I found underneath a nearby bridge. I like working with illusion and translucent materials. One of the experiments using the, the t section of the TV screen and behind is just a dried, a dried plant. So when you move from side to side, it'll appear and disappear and then also has a, a double effect. This is a, a fine, the fine TV screen and this is the full, the full scale of the wide screen. And you can see different scratches and, and marks on it. Um, and then this is a, a plant that I met and then placed behind out of paper and wood. So each of the little leaves I've, I've folded and I, I like to do it as a, a sort of form of meditation, just saying folding and yeah. So this piece is a, it's an experiment looking at light. So I cut out the windows and then what I had planned to do was to put another screen of translucent paper on top and then when it undulates in and out or you can move it in and out and then the light from the window is then projected also onto the little screen. So this one is a work in progress. I created this as a miniature model for hopefully a future larger piece. Yeah, so this is a, a greenhouse filled with different little dried plants and then they project out with the light, the, the form of them. I'd really love to build it life-size. So the plan is to build it life-size and then all the botanicals that are inside, I will hand make them myself. I love windows and, and light, but windows especially as a, a sort of portal or barrier between our inner and outer worlds and our man-made environments and our natural environments, just the, the crossover and the connection between the two. My, my work often looks into society's disconnection from the natural world and sort of blurring these lines between what is and isn't real and how that's becoming, that line is becoming increasingly blurred in our society. We're so often presented with falsified realities and adding the TV screen to this natural object almost makes it seem like it's, it's not real.